Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, whatever the hell it's called, it's kind of, the production value is amazing, I know, you're like, dude, it's got to have some cash to work with, right? <clears throat> Move a little bit more for the production value team, thank you guys, appreciate it. Anyway, you know how I love talking about the dark night, I well, don't love talking about it, but it's your experience, get it out there, maybe somebody else will be affected in, in a positive way, right? It's just telling some of your, someone your story and hoping it sticks, hoping there's something there they can use, right? And I was thinking about enlightenment and contemplation and meditation and yogis or whatever they call them, yogas or yogis, <laughs> gurus, Holy man, what are, those guys in the, in the east where everybody goes to India and wants to talk to the skinny dude that don't eat for a month or a year or a lifetime. You know, that's all, but you might want to save a plane ticket. You don't have to go to India. You don't have to eat, love, pray. Uh, the chick had money. Not everybody has the money to go run around to Europe and Rome and India. So I'm going to make it really simple. You've got to suffer. I'm sorry, what? See, you could go to a holy man all day long and say, well, what's the meaning of life? He's going to say, huh? well, have you suffered? Have you suffered enough to find the meaning? Because that's what it is. I think half the time they're just full of shit and they're, there's some ego running the show there because they want people to come to them to feel special. The important thing is that you feel special. Okay? Screw the yogis. Screw everybody else. You. It's all about you, babe. I want you to feel good. I want you to feel happy. And it, sometimes it's sitting in silence, sitting by yourself, staring out the window, you know, contemplating life, contemplating what you've been through, what your actions, the kind of person you are, <clears throat> your response to other people's bullshit, right? Positive and negative. But obviously if you're listening to this and you're a searcher, you're looking for inner peace, you're looking for a higher meaning, you're a cool human being. That's a good start, babe. The rest is just function and form, right? You're just going to get it. You're going to finally figure it out. And then you're going to, that light bulb is going to go off in you. And you're going to just be a whole different person. And everybody's going to say, who the hell are you? And they're gonna, you're going to tell them. They're going to say, really? They're not going to get it because they're low vibration idiots. But love and light. But seriously, I get time for that no more. You know what I mean? I'll enlighten everybody and their mama. But. But if you ain't coming along, you ain't coming along, man. I ain't pushing you on the train. That love train's going, whether you like it or not. If you don't want to take it, then kick rocks, babe. So, save your money. Don't go to India. Just find inner peace within yourself. All you need is a park. All you need is a space where you can meditate and you listen to nature, birds. Do it in your house. Do it in your cell. Do it in wherever you're going to be at, wherever in the world. In your car. Throw on some music. A lot of cards are pretty soundproof at this point, so. And I always recommend classical music or meditation music in traffic. I usually just do classical because it's nice and. <clears throat> but you can do New Age, whatever. But yeah, just love yourselves. You're going to have to sit in silence, babe, and you're going to suffer. But in the end, you're not going to be suffering as much. <laughs> You're not going to be, yeah, you're going to be a whole new person. It's, I mean, look at me. I'm ridiculous. Two years ago, three years ago, five years ago, you wouldn't recognize me. This is not me. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I'm not me. I, I wasn't who I am now. You understand? I was a miserable ball of goo. I was a lump of clay and I was just a miserable piece of shit. I was unhappy as hell. I'm not unhappy no more. But it took a lot of moments in silence. Not video games, not listening to the latest bullshit rapper. It's about sitting in silence and ignoring the world and listening to yourself, your inner self, the good inner self. Anyway, that's my lesson for today. I love yourself because you're amazing. I love you. God and the universe loves you. And love and light, people. Let me give you a little, little slice of my morning, how I woke up. And that was terrible. I love you guys. Have a wonderful day, okay?